Question number 44. Inability to perceive a visual stimuli as a whole is termed as. So when we talk about agnosia, remember it is a very rare condition. Visual agnosia is the most common type of agnosia and can be clinically describable. Here I will discuss the types of agnosia that was mentioned in the options. First is the somatognosia. In this case, patient will lose the awareness of his own body parts. He cannot recognize his arms or legs, etc. The second was the simultagnosia. It is the inability to perceive more than one object at a time. Now there are two types. First is the dorsal and second in the ventral. In dorsal, people cannot see more than one object at a time. In ventral, people can see more than one object but cannot identify more than one object. So here patient is unable to perceive visual stimuli as a whole. The third was the prosopagnosia. In this case, people is unable to recognize other people's faces. It is also called as face blindness. Now the last option was anosognosia. It is the inability to perceive the realities of one's own condition. It is seen in dementia patient or traumatic brain injury patient where the patient is unaware of his or her condition. So the answer is option B, simultaneous agnosia.